loves, thanks for returning. I hope this video finds you happy and doing well. As you know by the thumbnail, this video is going to be on affordable skincare. So if you're interested, then just keep watching. All right, so I have some skincare here that I would like to share with you. And the most expensive product that I'm gonna talk about is $16. Everything else is coming in at like $14.99 or less. So it's really affordable. Something that I think that all of you could easily get your hands on. I will provide links down below just in case you're interested. All right, so I'm just gonna go ahead and start off with the first item. And this is a foaming clay cleanser by Skin Fix. It comes in a little packaging like this. And typically when you think of clay cleansers and masks, you think of something that's probably going to tighten and maybe even dry out your skin. But this particular cleanser is very hydrating. They do use natural coconut cleansers as well as clays to gently remove dead skin cells. And it's real good at really um, breaking up dirt and removing makeup. So if you're looking for a cleanser that's going to be really good at removing makeup, this would be a really good one, while at the same time doing an effective job of removing dead skin cells. What I personally like about this is the, the consistency of it and the way it is foaming. It does feel very good on the skin. It does have a pleasant light very very light minimal smell this one is definitely worth a try and I think that if I'm not mistaken you can get it as low as $13 so if you're in the market for a good clay cleanser that is not going to strip away your skin and make it feel really tight and dry I would definitely give this one a try all right so this next one that I have is by good molecules and this is the pineapple exfoliating powder and this is it and it's activated by water and you only need a little bit of it. This particular exfoliator is good for someone with very, very gentle skin. You're not going to find the micro beads in this one. You're not going to find those little nutshells. Um, you're also not going to find AHAs. Not that there's anything wrong with AHAs, but sometimes they can be a little bit harsh for a person with very gentle skin. I can tell you that upon application, this is very smooth and silky. It does have natural rich starches in it and silk powders and you can literally feel it. And the enzyme rich pineapples that are in here are going to really loosen up the dead skin cells. So this one is coming in at the $16 and I would strongly recommend it to anyone out there that has extremely sensitive skin. All right, so this next one is by Miss Spa and this is the All Clear Enzyme Serum Peel and this is a gym gentle blend of AHAs and BHAs. So in this particular product, you're going to find lactic acid as well as salicylic acid. So this product is really good for someone who is probably battling acne as well as someone who really wants to exfoliate all of the dead skin cells. With this particular product, you only need to use this two to three times a week. I really wouldn't recommend using this particular product more than that if you are a newbie to any type of AHAs and BHAs. It does have a good mix of antioxidants that are good for the skin. So if you're looking for something that has salicylic acid as well as lactic acid, this would be a good one to pick. All right, so the next product that I have is by The Ordinary, and this is their Caffeine Solution 5% Plus EGCG. And this one is really good in preventing eye puffiness. It's also really good at preventing pigmentation in your eye contour. And that's why I pretty much picked this up because I tend to have puffiness um, under my eye as well as pigmentation issues. And just in case you didn't know, across the board, Ordinary has so many great products to really look into and consider. All right, so this next one is by Gopier and it's a vitamin C serum. We all love vitamin C, right? We all want our skin to be radiant and bright and this particular serum is going to do it. This one does have ferulic acid, vitamin E, and green tea. It does come in a tinted bottle because as you all know, direct sunlight can hurt the formulation of vitamin C and I know that I'm saying 
saying that wrong. It, it can hurt its molecular structure. I think that's a better way to put it, but I do like the packaging with this. And plus, it's just a really quality product for the price. They have a lot of affordable products. I've used so many of their products, their cleansers, their moisturizers, their eye creams, just a lot of stuff, their facial scrubs, a really good product. But I particularly love this one because I have had great results from it. So this is a good one to try. The next one that I have is by e.l.f. and this is their Super Hydrate and Moisturizer with Hydrating Squalling. This is a very light moisturizer and it kind of reminds you of jelly. It is really, it's clear. So, let's see if sure if y'all can So, I'm not sure if y'all can see that, but it is clear and it's in, it kind of reminds me of just a light jelly form. So, it does have squalene in it and as many of you all know, squalene is used to help with elasticity. It also has vitamin E, which helps to nourish and moisturize the skin. And it also has niacinamide in it, which is good for clarifying and toning. So, this particular moisturizer just has so many ingredients that's really going to help protect your skin against free radicals and keep it moisturized. But for me, the main attraction is the squalene. And the squalene, again, is going to help with elasticity as well as keeping the skin moisturized. So this is a good, affordable product to try. So that's it. Those are all of the skincare products that I wanted to talk about that are $16 or less. Let me know, have you used any of the products that I spoke about or are you using any other affordable ones? Let me know down in the comments. I'd love to hear about it. Thank you so much for tuning in and until my next video. Smooches.